All right, so we just got a sneak peek by Prodigy themselves at what a new update is going to be. This is an update that is going to be coming to gear items in Prodigy. So let's break down what Prodigy has said about this upcoming update. All right, so this comes from the Prodigy Wiki, a post made by Prodigy themselves. It reads, Big changes to gear coming soon. Young Wizards, we have some exciting upcoming updates to gear. Soon, the gear you wear will play an important part in battles with gear stats. With new stats, equipping stronger gear will boost your power, while weaker gear might make your battles more challenging. Gear will also become level locked, meaning that you'll have to reach a certain level before equipping certain pieces. Now this is very intriguing, we have health bonuses on gear, but we don't have any power bonuses excluding the, um, the Ice Dragon Tooth Crown, which has a power bonus of 10, I believe. So that is going to be something really interesting if it means what I think it means, which is that all gear items will have some sort of power bonus. I assume that does not include buddies, of course. But also, weaker gear making battles more challenging? I don't really quite understand what that means. I guess we'll just have to wait and see for what it actually does mean. Well, would it just make the battles tougher? That That's just confusing. As I said, we'll have to wait and see. Maybe it'll just be the obvious answer that you would want- you would have less hearts and you would like to have more hearts in battles, but I don't even know if we're going to have hearts with extra hearts with gear items anymore. That's what we will have to see when this update actually comes out. And level locking on gear items is something that isn't exactly new. There have been level locking specifically on wands. There has been level locking on wands for a long time now, so I guess it means on all items, which I don't think it has been on like any hats or outfits before. So apparently they are going to be level locking some of the other gear items so that you have to be a certain level to wear them. An important note for all wizards, for gear that you are already wearing, you'll be allowed to keep it equipped. But if you take it off for any reason, please know that you may not be able to put it back on if your current level is lower than the gear's required level. So what this means is that before this update happens, the gear that you are wearing at the time, you can keep it on even if you are not quite the level that the gear requires. But if you do take it off, you will not be able to put it back on if you're below that level. And that just makes me wonder, how high are the level restrictions going to go? Like, are some gear items going to be only available for level 100s? That is what we will have to see. This update is very interesting, and I am excited to see what it has to offer. Stay tuned for more details on the official launch next week. So, we are given a time frame for when this update will happen. Next week, so sometime next week, we will be seeing this update in Prodigy. So it won't be long before we will know the true mysteries of what this teaser is providing. Along with the text I read, we were provided an image to go along with it. This image shows the snowman head hat with a blue background, a dark blue background, which is just like the new backgrounds that we saw in the shop update a few weeks ago. So it looks like that update will also be coming to the backgrounds of the items in your Prodigy backpack, which I am excited for. It also has two green arrows pointing upward beside it. I believe that that means that it has a power level of 2. We really don't know anything about this except for what Prodigy has just now told us. Really, I don't know what these green arrows mean. It's probably the second level of power, but I don't know what the levels of power are. 
Again, we will just have to wait and see when this update releases next week. Of course, when this update releases, I will be posting a video about it, so stay tuned for that. And let me know what you think about this new update so far in the comments.